just arrived to see Castle Sinclair Journey Goal. I think there's a walking group going down. There's about a dozen people together. From the picture I've seen of it, it looks spectacular. So we're in for a treat. That's what it is. It's a bit of a cloudy day. It's been wet all morning, actually. This may look pretty grim, but at least it isn't raining like it was this morning. Let's go and investigate this old castle with a lot of history. It is uh, early afternoon now, and this is our first stop for today. We can see the sighting of it over there. What's left of it, the remains. We have different wildlife to look out for. It's looking pretty epic. Look at that. Pretty incredible to uh, see that. And uh, animals and plants, they live in the slates in between to protect themselves from the harsh conditions. What an epic castle this used to be. You see the history of this castle, 1300 to 1400, 1400, 1530, 1530, 1610 nearly 300 years, 200 years, 1610 to 1680. Okay, we're inside. Let's check it out. An incredible structure, wasn't it? Well, like I said, there's not much of it left now. The windows are like very deep. And yeah, we got something down here. We're not able to get it off. All the best bits are all gated off. Look at it. Imagine that for a shot. Look at it. This is a bit to the underground bit. Gated off again. It is really a mess, isn't it? Talk about disrepair. So this was a main building. Look at that. Pretty grand. Really amazing grounds. This window bit here is still partially intact up there. Do you see it? And the chimney, the top. That's 500 years. That's incredible. Okay, let's go and walk down here and get a bit closer to the waves. Wow, Whew. that is a bit of a drop. That is just insane. Let's go to the end. We're on this uh, last standing bit of rock. Wow. Oh my God. Ooh. Epicness overload. But also scary because to my left I've got this, to my right I've got this. It is uh, giving me the jitters. Look at those slabs of rock. My legs are actually shaking, literally, because it's so kind of... Uh, I don't think I've been on a cliff edge either side of me like this before. Pretty epic. Wow, this coastline is incredible. On a day like yesterday, when I was at the castle in Tong, it was really windy, gale force. 
it'll be too risky to go on this a drop to my this way a drop to that way and a drop to this way if a big gust of wind blew me off i'd be gonna imagine walking on that talk about slip city we just want to go and look down here underneath the bridge paths everywhere look at the red brick for the windows but look at this view wow see if you look carefully you can see what what the erosion has done where they started building the castle on top and 500 years of erosion you can see this is the mark of the erosion over many hundreds of years hundreds of years and you can see what they started building the castle on top of it Look at this! Wow! Pretty incredible what the current is doing. It comes in at a fair pace, very strong at times. It really comes in and it's working 24-7 to erode all this. Then eventually all this will collapse to the ground with this and this maybe in a thousand years it'll be all tumbling down or if not sooner wow pretty blown away i don't believe it i don't believe it this car's here again we saw the smooth cave we saw it near john o'groats it's this uh, car and his biker mates they're all doing the same nc500 west to east like us i can't believe i've seen this like doing the same going the same places like it's insane <laughs> it's insane but uh, yeah we're gonna move on now uh and uh, i've got a little treat for you we'll go to the coast again and to some special steps